Our eyes are the windows through which we see the world. But as we age, visual function can be affected if vital nutrients essential for optimal eye health are lacking. Support your eyes with Vision Plus. Formulated to protect eye health as you age by replenishing lost vital nutrients like lutein. Good vision is important, so take care of your eyes by supplementing with Vision Plus Eye Antioxidant. Find it today at a pharmacy near you. Vision Plus. Seeing is believing. Good day, my colleagues. This session will focus mainly on how you develop your SWOT analysis and how you take your SWOT analysis to TOS metrics and how you are able to use the TOS metrics as basis to develop your strategies for the year 2017 in order to take advantage of the opportunities. The foundational thing you need to do for TOS metrics is to do SWOT analysis. Your SWOT analysis is a, an analysis of your strength, the op, uh, analysis of your weaknesses, which are based on analysis of the internal resources available to you from HR to marketing to information management, operations to technology to leadership to strategy development or any form of resource available to you. If they are positive for you, they are straight. You are relatively at a disadvantage on them, that's a weakness. But relative to competitor, if you have an advantage over competitors on any of those internal resources parameters, that's, those are strengths for you. Now, the opportunities are threats are usually based on external environment, not internal. These are political environment, economic environment, socio-cultural environment, technology environment, ecology or geography, substitutes, suppliers, competitors, customers, cooperatives and cooperators, as well as staff union. And when something is positive for us in the external environment, it's an opportunity. If it's negative for us, you see, then it's a threat. Having established this, you therefore develop strength, your group of strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats called SWOT analysis. SWOT analysis is an analytical tool, and I'm sure you are all familiar with this. But the analytical tool is not sufficient alone for you to prepare for the year that you are planning for. You therefore have to move it and develop what is called TOS matrix. TOS matrix derives from the word T-O-W-S. In TOS matrix, you develop, you use your strength to take advantage of opportunities. Those are referred to as SO strategies. How do you use your strength to address the threats in the external environment? Those strategies that you develop in that format are referred to as ST strategies. You also identify WO strategies, which is, in spite of your weaknesses, how do you take advantage of the opportunities in the marketplace, or how do you maximize it? How do you simultaneously deal with your weaknesses and threats? Those strategies are referred to as W3 strategies. So you will have a group of four group of strategies as well. But our suggestion and advice is that you focus mainly on SO strategies. That is, how do you make use of your strength? To take advantage of the opportunities so rather than agonize on your weaknesses and threats you just focus on the opportunities and make the best use of of your strength so you develop strategies around it that will have taken care of over 80 percent of the opportunities you have in the marketplace and in this form you will have addressed what you've taught before on pareto's principle 80 20 rule we, rec we, re we recommend this year that you focus mainly using tools metrics to focus on using your strength to take advantage of the opportunities in the marketplace. In the next session, we'll be sharing with you what leadership needs to do. Thank you.